Well, I don't really care what happens in the El Clasico being a neutral. I just want to see entertaining football in. Wow, did we get that? That was unreal football, particularly from Barcelona. Even though they won 4-0, Real Madrid still had a fair few chances and you've got to give major credit to Claudio Bravo. He made some exceptional saves. Barca deserved the win, of course they did, but I think Real Madrid deserved one or two goals and maybe Barca... Well, they got four anyway, so they would have smashed them regardless. But it was such a good game. And right from the off, it's end-to-end. The first ten minutes before the goal, I think Real Madrid had a chance. Barca had a chance. It was literally end-to-end stuff. And Barca, the way they passed the ball is unreal. Uh, Messi was on the bench for this, and that's what makes it even more remarkable. The player that got brought in was Rakitic. But also they've got Sergio Roberto, who was absolutely fantastic. And in the first uh, the first goal, he basically dribbles it round. It's a lovely through ball through to Neymar. It is Neymar, isn't it? It's Neymar Suarez. Literally, my mind's went completely mad with all the things. But anyway, one of them... I th- no, it's Suarez, isn't it? Suarez scores the first one, and it's a lovely outside-the-boot finish into the bottom left. Fantastic. And from then on in... It was it was all Barca, to be honest. There was just, uh, every now and then, Real Madrid would break and it would be a fantastic save or a great defensive uh, clearance or something like that from Barcelona. But anyway, it, it's extended. Neymar does get on the score sheet. I mean, the, the link-up play between Neymar and Suarez is just unreal. The chemistry they have, considering Messi was injured since September, the end of September, it, it's crazy. They Before this game, they both had 10 goals a piece and they, they have been involved I think with 20 goals out of the 23 that Barcelona have scored this season it's just remarkable and yeah Neymar makes it 2-0 lovely finish and again it's it's just all Barcelona and I think I th- is the third goal before or after like I'm struggling this, there was so much attacking football it was so nice to watch I can't remember all of it, it it's crazy the passing Iniesta had a blinding game he was Ridiculous. He was pinging balls all the way. He was playing like Iniesta in his prime. And it was really, really good to see. The interlinking play and the just one-two movements of Barcelona was just so good to watch. And yeah, they make it three. And then later on, they, they score again. Like They, they had so many chances, but um, Neymar, I think, gets the second one to make it 4-0. And it, it's, just, it's just a rout. They could have had even more. There were so many chances. Right at the end, Monaye has a, uh, is it Monet, Munier, I don't know how, how you pronounce it, but anyway, he's a bit greedy, the ball's played into him, left footed and just wide, uh, he could have left it for Piquet, who had, would have had a tap in, Real Madrid, they had their chances, as I say, but Bravo was fantastic, the best chance fell to Ronaldo, it's a, it, the ball's played directly in front of him, and he manages to get a, a decent finish on it, to be honest, but does it hit Bravo's head? I'm not entirely sure, like, it just, Bravo seemed to be everywhere, there was corners, he was getting top class saves, Barca had other chances as well, you had a Neymar free kick that was tipped over, it was just so much attacking football, and that's why I can't even form coherent sentences, I can't even remember what the hell I'm supposed to talk about, this is supposed to be a review, and I'm forgetting the goals and chances and everything, because it was so much, it was action packed, and at the same time, you've got Liverpool smashing Manchester City. I mean, wow, what two hours of football that has been. I haven't seen the Man City versus Liverpool game, but I can't wait to on match of the day. Even though I'm a Man United fan, I did want Liverpool to win this for the fact that Man City are closer to us. And now we retain second in the league, which is good. And uh, yeah, heading into the top of the table clash, Leicester versus Manchester United. What the fuck is going on this season, man? Honestly, this game, this day has been fantastic as a neutral fan of La Liga and also a fan of Manchester United. So let me know what you think of the El Clasico in particular. That, that was just destruction. Honestly, Barcelona are just next level.